I don't really know how to explain all this shit. So basically, this particular song was written years before I was even in the band. So this is what they used to do before I joined the band. They used to make these little MIDI CDs in, a, or these little MIDI tracks in a noteworthy performer, right? Is that what it's called? Composer. Noteworthy composer. It sounded pretty ridiculous. It sounded a little something like this, but it was just for reference. This would be the first thing we laid down in the studio, and then would be the drums would play to this track. Right here, it sounds something like this. All the guitar parts and stuff were all on this little piano thing. I basically took this, uh, tried to base a, a click off of this in Pro Tools, and this song was especially hard to do because it has like if you look up here at this top bar, these are all the meter changes just for this song. That's kind of a pain in the ass. So what you just heard was what we had to start with. And then from there, we made a click track. Blah, blah, blah. I did the drums on this program called the Drum Kit from Hell. Pretty cool. Like a drop and drag sort of program. Pull it up. Has all these different uh, loops and shit. Got some fucking blast beats and stuff. That we'll never use. But anyway, yeah, it, it's basically like a drop and drag program. It has the basic beats and the basic fills. For this particular song that we're going to listen to right now, I don't think there's one goddamn beat in there that I didn't have to change around or like cater to the song, move hits around and stuff. So from the click, I got to this. I think I might have laid down. Uh, no, I, I worked off the MIDI track. So this is basically the drums of that. And then we laid down all our shit to it. This song has the best mix. This song's pretty slim and sounding. Yeah, but that's boring. No one's gonna wanna hear that. Yeah, you gotta whack it a little sometimes.